Today I will show you how to make this crazy heat effect. Yo, it's Povikas here and let's begin. So here I have a clip from the one and only Ghost Killer music video. And here we can just start making the effect. So the first thing we can do is press Ctrl Y to make a new adjustment layer. And here we can add curves. Now this effect is actually used to make thermal effects. And this is kind of in alignment with this effect because lava effect is kind of a thermal effect in itself. So here we can make one point here and one point here. And we're gonna drag this point down quite a lot like there, as you can see, like the lava is kind of starting to come out already and take this point and just drag it like right here i think and this one we need to drag a bit further down that looks perfect all right now for you it might look a bit silly but don't worry we will make this way better as we go on so now the most important effect you need to add here is color rama now at the start it just will look like this so don't freak out so now we need to make the get face from saturation and you will start to see like these pixels now that's very good i really like this pixel because it makes the look feel more a bit damaged you know and let's go to output cycle and here let's go use preset palette and here it's important to set it to fire and now you already have like this cool fire lava heat look so you can like already keep it and i th i think this is amazing look so we can definitely like save this as a preset if you know how to say presets but we can still keep going so another effect i like to add here and i think it's pretty important for this is uni dot heat wave now for this effect you actually need the universe plugin but it's super recommended to have the universe plugin so you should probably have this effect already and here i like to make the heat intensity kind of high to 38 now this will basically have heat like this is like the heat effect and another effect i like to add here which is optional by the way it's s flicker you only need to add this if you actually have the sapphire plugin and it's a nice little touch to add and i like to make the amplitude here to 0.3 it's just going to flicker and it's gonna look really cool and the last effect i like to add here is fast box blur and i like to make the blur radius to two this just damages the look and makes it look a bit more like heat here we basically have the effect now you might think why is this different from the intro of the video well it's because you actually need to right click go to blending mode and make it to lighten and you will start to have your effect as you can see like it attaches like lava or heat i don't know how to call it now you can also just make the blending mode to normal and just have it like this which is amazing and you can also go to one of the effects press ctrl a go to animation save animation preset and here you can actually save it as like heat a lava look and press save and whenever you want to add this effect you'll be able to go to effects and presets and type heat lava look and just drop the effect and you will have the effect instantly but anyways it was fun have a fun and productive day see ya